If you've ever heard anyone refer to sand and visqueen, this is what they're talking about. A six millimeter thick, which doesn't sound like much, but it is, six millimeter thick layer of plastic is laid over the top of the dirt or soil to protect any moisture from coming up into the foundation. If it was ever to rain and the, and the dirt got saturated, trust me, water leaks right underneath your house and it can actually leak up into the floor. So you have carpet tile, you get a spot, uh, it could be a problem. I actually worked on a job where there was oil leaking up from the Visqueen. That was interesting. So the Visqueen protects the foundation from moisture. Now the next part is the sand. What is the purpose for putting the sand down? It, without the sand, the concrete would take a little longer to dry and you would have the plastic right up against the concrete and if there was any movement in the foundation, the concrete or the soil, it could easily rip the um, visqueen or protective plastic there. This is actually a moisture barrier. That's what some the other people will refer to it as a moisture barrier. So the moisture barrier is the visqueen. That eliminates some of the water and I'm not going to uh, tell you that it eliminates all of the water because if you look you will notice that the concrete footings are not protected and you are not allowed to run the visqueen into the footings at all. It, they can't even lap into the footings. So this this got to give you a pretty good idea if you are ever wondering what sand and visqueen looks like if uh, any of the contractors were ever talking behind your back or making stuff up. It's true. There it is.